two federally protected birds have been shot in one front range community and wildlife officers certainly want to know who did it. One bird survived, the other did not. Both the turkey vultures were found in Longmont near Central Elementary School in Thompson Park. One in May, one last week. Michael Abeda on that story. Michael, they are protected by the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service. Yeah, Jim, they are, and that means that if you hurt one, you're going to be in some serious trouble. Still, residents who live near downtown Longman say something needs to be done because the turkey vultures are taking over. It sticks pretty harsh, and it sticks to the cars, and it, yeah, it's, it's not fun dealing with it at all. The past few summers for Jody Halsey and Candace Hayes have been pretty gross. The regurgitation, the fecal matter, and the waste. That's what they've had to clean off of their yards and cars because turkey vultures roost in the trees in front of their Longmont homes. And they aren't alone. People all over Longmont have to deal with the birds with little recourse because they're a federally protected species. But that didn't stop someone from shooting two with a pellet gun just around the corner from Jody and Candace's neighborhood. CPW says the first incident was in May, and the most recent one was June 15th or 16th. Jody and Candace say that shooting the birds is not a solution. Oh my gosh, no. You know, Absolutely not. I'm like the last person to be like, kill them all. I'm not like that at all. We're not going to kill any of the birds. That's not, our, that's not at all because no. they don't need to be killed. They do think they need to be scared away. They've asked the city of Longmont for help, but they say aside from hanging effigies the women made themselves to scare them off, the city hasn't lent a hand. They hope someone will step in before more birds get hurt and more summers are spent cleaning up vulture poop. All we're asking is for some help. It's not going to get any better. Now, I did call the city for a response, and they didn't get back to me. And if you still think that shooting one of these birds is a good idea, the penalty, should you get caught, is up to $15,000. If you know anything about these vultures that were shot either in May or June out here near Central Elementary, call Colorado Parks and Wildlife. In Longmont, Michael Aveta, covering Colorado First.